little kittens. Jeez, guys. What have you been doing on this side of the fence? You left over your carrier. Built some litter. Almost hit the laser pin. Is that you, Hal? You were squeaking at me with that little itty bitty tiny little kitten squeak. Hey, Eddie. I like seeing you too. Check your food. Sunshine does not belong in the food. Sunshine is not food. Good on the skin. And it's a toy. But that's it. Now look at Jarvis. He didn't run when I sat down. Eddie just moved out of the way. You guys went on a rampage yesterday. You got some stuff, something stuff in your fur there, boy. Come here. Yeah, you were crazy rampaging yesterday. A little bit of the stuff stuck in your fur. Not a scratching post. Holly has decided that he likes the cheek rubs. Hi, Eddie. Mama Pern. She seems to be doing better today. I saw her up walking around. She jumped up here. Let's see if I can get her out. Let's check our boy bits. They all look, hey, wait a minute, that's not for you. That's for Mama. Lick up all the powders. Okay, I'll split this up for you guys.
keeps the rain, man. Get another treat ready for us for a pepper over. You think your mouth smells good? <laughs> you get treat breath. Mm. There's a happy Gladys. She loves her cheek rubs. I could tell she's still feeling a little some discomfort from her surgery, which is expected. You tell because the way she keeps her tail down. But she's purring. Seems in good spirits. She's stretching, that's good. And moving around. Hi how. She's like balancing on top of the fence. Climbed over too far. The tower's over that way. That's a good boy, not using your claws. Here, grabbing my hand to lick the fingers. And to think Eddie was shy of hands a week ago. Well, got a shark sniffing my toe. Ticklish feet.
Jarvis was even more hand shy than Eddie. Gladys, don't go back in just yet. They look good, Mom. They look good. Here you go. Well, that's a play ring there. She likes to play inside that. Is that your mom? That's a good mom. You can go back in there now. She's playing a little bit, not much. She's still pretty sore. But she's improving as I expect she would. You want to stay out more pennies? I can accommodate you. Gladys has silky fur. She has a really short coat, which makes it so her un her silver undercoat is quite visible. It gives her a striped appearance when she's in bright light. She's a smoky black, and her Surrender paper word from the shelter she came from lists her as a Siamese slash Egyptian, Egyptian Mao, which, since she, since she was astray, it's just a shot in the dark guess. By no means is she a purebred or anything close. So, being Egyptian Mao Siamese in itself says not a purebred. Okay, Mom, go ahead and get away from the kittens. You leave mommy alone.
Kitten tipping is like cow tipping, a lot cuter. All these whiskers are still pretty curly. Not showing any signs of straightening out either. We'll have another collar climation exercise, which basically is collar fitting and getting them used to it later. And I will take graduation photos of the kittens. But these guys seem to have done really well with the collars. Toy, toy, not me, toy. Bowl full of kitten makes the world go round. Okay, everyone. Enjoy the kittens. Have a nice day.